Hi, and welcome to Sojo Quilty Stitchy Things. I'm Mary Jo, also known as MJ, Mojo, Jojo, or Sojo. What I have today is I've got my unboxing from Creative Notions. Now this is the October 2022 bag. I know, it's January 2023, but yes, this is October. Unfortunately, they've had a bunch of delays um, from shipping, and they're working to get that caught up, but let's get into it. in that bag. Let's see. Now Creative Notions always sends it inside this mailer and inside this mailer they always have this drawstring bag which is nice. Now this drawstring bag, this one comes in this pretty sparkly fabric here. Looks like Christmas trees. But let's see what's inside. See what all the goodies are. This Let's see. Open it up. Here we go. Now, Creative Notion also always sends us some sort of snack or treat. And this month, they've sent us some popcorn. Although, by the looks of it, that kind of smacked. That's okay. We'll eat it. And if I won't, my daughter will. So, it's okay. Now, let's see what else we got. A retractable tape measure. Let's open it. Now these things, my husband and kids always seem to take and they disappear or they break them. So let's see. That's nice. Blue, my favorite color. I don't know if you can see, they've got their logo embossed right in there. Awesome. Now let's see what else we got here in this bag of goodies. We got our fabric. We'll look at it in a minute. Now, we've got a recipe card. They always send in a recipe card with this. This one's for fried green or red tomatoes. Now, these recipe cards I'm not a cooker. I, I like, I'm scary in the kitchen. You, you don't want me to cook for you. So even though this is quilting bad, they send us, send us. I think it's a nice gesture, but it's really not something I use. Although I do like me some tomatoes. Let's see. The Holiday Sparkle is the name, the name of this collection by Canvas Studios for Binertex. Alright, we've got nine fat quarters, which we'll go over that in a minute. And then, let's see, which is those nine fat quarters is a $30 value. We also have a ruler. That's for foundation piecing. Let's see. It's a two by 11 and a half inch foundation paper piecing ruler. We got this. There we go. I'm assuming this red line is probably for that quarter inch for when you're doing paper base, paper foundation pacing to cut it off. Nice. Always like a ruler. Love me some rulers. Let's see. Now we got our pattern. Now our pattern this month is for a braided table runner and four placement set. Go. So this is the pattern as well as this on the back. Definitely more of that holiday theme, but there's always there's always another holiday coming around, another year, right? Let's see. Now, here's that foundation paper piecing for a garden bloom block of the month. I do like foundation paper piecing. And here, let's take a look at this. See what we got? There we go. We've got these foundation paper pieces in here. For that. Like a rose block going on there. It says that it's a 
12 and a half inch rose foundation paper, paper, paper piecing double sided printed paper, eight pack. Now with that, it's also giving you these ideas of using this to make the table runner if you want it, using those foundation paper piecing. Now they also come with a block of the month. Um, they started a couple, a couple months ago, and this month they sent us actually two blocks of the month into a, a big quilt. The layout was sent a few months ago, but we've got this, this block of a month to go into a sampler quilt. And there's where we use that foundation paper piecing paper, which, like I said, if you didn't want to do the quilt, they sent us a couple months ago, you can always use it in this table runner. In addition to that, we also have this sunflower pattern. Alright, now let's look at these fat quarters. They are definitely very much holiday with a gold embossed like fabric to it, metallic. Alright, so this is the first one they sent us. Now these are all fat quarters. This is the second one. I do like this one. Black. There's different reindeer in there. And this is the same, just in a cream print. Like some pine cones and needles on the tree. Looks like a poinsettia there leaf. Same one in red. Now I think this is probably my favorite one here. Got some red and some gray in there. I'm sorry, I said red, it's not red, it's white. <laughs> white, cream, gold, with a little bit of grays in there. And just a plain black. So those are the fat quarters we received this month. Now, it says that the total value of this bag is $81. Um, I believe this was just under 50 is what I believe is what I pay for every month. I'm not sure. I'd have to take a look at that, but I believe that's what it is. Uh, the fabric, the nine fabric fat quarters is a $30 value. The ruler is a $14 value. The paper piecing, papers, um, come out to be a $10 value. The tape measure is a $7 value. The two block of the month patterns, they list those as five. And then the pattern for the table runner is five. Oh, I'm sorry, it would be this. The pattern for this is five, and then the braided table runner is ten for a total value of eighty-one dollars. And this, this is just something they send us as a treat, and they don't really sign a value. All right. So what do you think? Tell me. I'm I'm good. Um, I I'm okay with it. I'm happy with this box. Um. All right. See you next time. Join me next time for all where we talk about all the quilty stitchy things. Bye.